is ready for this. Let me bring in Congressman King. Despite the comments of, of Senator Feinstein, do you think Tsarnaev should be treated as a criminal or an enemy combatant? I believe he should uh, be treated as an enemy combatant for the purpose of interrogation. I've uh, put out a statement with Senator McCain, Senator Graham, Senator Ayotte. The reason for it is there are so many questions unanswered. There are so many potential links to terrorism here. Also, the battlefield is now in the United States, so I believe he is an enemy combatant. And he would not be tried before a military commission. Ultimately, he would be tried in a civilian court, and the statements taken from him cannot be used against him in that trial. But right now, he is really one of the only links we have as far as any check involvement in the al-Qaeda movement, in the uh, uh, overall Islamist movement, and we don't know, uh, are there other conspirators out there? Are there other explosives out there? Where do they get their radicalization? Are there mosques, imams we should be looking at? What, uh, uh, who did his brother meet with when he was in Russia and Chechnya? These are only questions that I believe can be obtained through if he uh, does not get his Miranda rights. Because it, even though right now there's the public safety exception, that's going to expire in about 48 hours. And after that, he can lawyer up and stay quiet. I'm not interested. He's going to be convicted one way or the other in a civilian court. Right now, it's to get intelligence. This is a unique opportunity I mean to go into a treasure trove of intelligence. Only he has it.